I mean, I should have figured that was a trap, but... Hmm. We just might be able to do it. Oh, thank you. If you're gonna heal me, then... Good stuff. Nothing new for now. And yet you managed to get your dumb asses, like, pincer attacked by us. So, good work. Okay, so I still get kicked out. So... We sneak in using the rail. We don't sneak in using the rail. We sneak in using the girders. Look at that dancing old man! Just to add a few too many. Because for some reason, that worked. Cool. Nice to know that's a it, you can block it or not thing. Oh, an extra bio blaster in case we needed it.
Extra Bio Blaster, more like I think everything here is just you're supposed to use magic on them. Totally forgot about actual summons. They're hype. They're super hype. Yeah, cat voice. Everybody's confused. They're going to fight each other. Jeez, Kira is expensive as hell, but... I don't think I can get that treasure chest directly below me without leaving the area. I think I gotta come back for it. Thunderblade! Remedy!
All right. Go for the obvious thing first. I want to see how much that are... No, never mind. I guess not. Excuse me. Dragoon boots. Uh-oh. You might be weak to magic, but you're just as weak to chainsaw, apparently. That'll be next break, Mina. Golden Shield. Okay, so that was totally worth it. The Nozika wants you to say all skill names out loud for three minutes. Awesome. Uh, hitting this guy! Flash tool! And, uh, yeah, hitting that guy! Camera flash! Bushido flurry! Sandara Kupo. <laughs> what have you done to me, Kupo? Stealing on the kids' lunch money, Kupo. Camera flash, Kupo. Never mind, they're dead, Kubo. Ouch, Kubo. Camera flash, Kubo.
golden helm, Koopo. That's probably really good, Koopo. It's not as good as I thought it was, Koopo. I'm not sure I'm willing to take that into magic evasion, Koopo. Stealing that dude's lunch money, Koopo. Edgar Voorhees, Koopo. That worked great, Koopo. Tiger Bushido Koopo. Stealing some more lunch money, Koopo. We're all blind, Koopo. Chainsaw twirl, Koopo. Okay, cool. I just realized I actually didn't have to say skill names for those last two minutes, but I did it anyway. That's right. Your boy commits to a bit. Hitting that guy, Koopo. <laughs> Stealing that kid's lunch money, Koopo. That's, uh, that's, that's terrible. It's gonna do the last few. Oh, that's a, that's a very dead onion night. That's a very dead onion night. Oh, that's not, that's the thing I didn't know y'all could do. Excellent. feeling I'm about to be really disappointed. I really want those two treasure chests over there, and I think I have to, like, go back to get them. Like, a significant amount of effort backwards. And that's how you get Salus' magic back. Hmm. 
Come on, do some more lasers. That's not that thing that I asked of you to do just now. Can you stop that? Alice has learned regen. Now she just needs to learn Kira, and we're golden. I don't think anything's gonna be as cool as Cool Frogs, though. Just go, I do. And then I can squeeze in here. God, I love when that works. I love when that works too. Oh boy, another Bio Blaster. Whatever will I do with them all? Ice Brand. Oop. I love Chainsaw Spin. I love it. I love Chainsaw Spin. Unironically, I do adore it. Zephyr Cloak sounds amazing. Boosts evasion and magic evasion. That sounds like a winner to me. And you know what? Let's get rid of Hermes sandals. Let's see if we can't find something more exciting. Yeah, that looks like a winner. I think Ganya Knights only have like 250. Ooh, I think that's Cyan being done with Ramu. Uh oh. The only thing that he can learn from left is. Kirin. So we're gonna... okay.
Oh, Siren gives the HP plus 10%, so it's not terrible that Cyan's stuck with it. That's fine. I'll make Cyan tanky. I don't care. I care a little, but, like, it's, it's good care. God, I love this game. And now we've got a bunch of characters learning stuff again, which is what we need to be. Oh, I can jump through here. Love it. Hi, Kefka. Hey, what's up? I'm a god! I'm all powerful! <laughs> I'll collect more espers, I'll extract their magic, and then... I'll revive the Warring Triad! I've already drained all your powers! You're useless to me now! You too! Take a hike! And Shiva? Jeez, I know. It's okay, guys. I'm coming. That is kind of funny. Oh, that's bad. Are you? I sense a familiar strength. You have Ramu's power? Wait. Where Esper's? Hmm. I can see why Ramu entrusted you with his power. When they finish draining us of our powers, they dump us down here to die. 
We haven't much time left. Gestal has captured many more of us. They're all here being drained of their powers. I, too, suffered my turn in one of the capsules. We and Ramu are siblings, each of us born with a different elemental power. If Ramu is willing to give you his strength, then we shall do the same. Our friends are also running out of time. I'm sure they will lend you their strength as well. New Magicite, baby! Which means I can equip you with something else! Rasp, Osmos, Cure? You learn Blizzara quick, but... Let's get you Fyra and Drain and a level... And a level up bonus that we can really get behind. Boy, I have a feeling that's not actually where I want to go yet. <gasps> Flan! Hey, we're going to give you a chance to heal and save because there's something that you can horribly screw up coming up. At least that's how I'd take it. I can actually attack things now with with lock? Oh my god. Oh god. The capsules are terrifying. That is a dead... Oh, God, no, it is not. Phenomenal. Bach gets a little magic, which is good for him. Boy, you sure do have the stance of a boss waiting to happen. Number 24.
Oh, that's that's getting that's getting really bad. Level 20. Oh god. Oh god. Everybody's dead. Level 20. 320 in HP. 245 MP. No weaknesses. Oh good, you snapped yourself out of it. Phenomenal, I love it. Just get everybody back alive as fast as possible. System error. Level 24, 4,000 HP. Vulnerable to water? Why is there a bunny? Vulnerable to holy? I don't have holy that I can think of. Stole a rune blade, that's expensive. Yeah, let's just... Yeah, I think he's a throwback to the boss in Final Fantasy 3 where you had to use a scholar to identify his weakness every so often. But we did it. He kicked the bucket. We didn't. All thanks to a chainsaw. Maduin and Bismarck and... I think that's Carbuncle and... Unicorn and... No, that's Carbuncle. So I have no idea what that monstrosity on the right is. And... You wish to help us, but we haven't long to live. We will follow Ifrit's example. Our power we entrust to you.
What are you doing over there? What are these? So when espers die, they can leave behind the essence of their powers. The power contained within these stones must be far greater than what we could ever hope to extract. Hundreds of times greater. Interesting. Obtained Magicite. And a lot of it. Professor Sid. General Celis, who are these shady characters? Your underlings? No. You see, I... Is it true you infiltrated the rebel group as a spy? Celis? Oh, I see. Magis... I'm sorry, that's Kefka. Oh, I see! Magicite! Excellent work, Sid! General Celis, we needn't keep up the charade any longer. Bring me those magicite crystals. Celis, you tricked us? Of course not. Please trust me. <laughs> the sweet taste of betrayal. Oh, Celis, that's so... you. Locke, believe me. I... Now! Kill them all! Let me protect you for once, and maybe, maybe then you'll believe me. Celis! Wh what are you doing? Stop! Please give back the Kirin Magicite. What happened? Oh no, this is bad. That blast reversed the energy flux in the extraction chambers. We need to get out of here. I cast goodbye. Quick, over here. Oh, what have I done? There's no excuse for it, no matter how much Kefka may have threatened me. Training the eye for energy from the espers just to make people stronger. You've helped me come to a decision. I'm going to talk to the Emperor and make him realize how foolish this whole war is. You gonna get killed, son. Celis. I've known her ever since she was a child. I doted on her as if she were my own daughter. But I also forced her to become a Magitech Knight. If I ever get to see her again, I want to apologize for all of my mistakes. Oh no, it's Kafka. Go! Sid also casts by. Bye, Magna Rotor. Cool, that's a... Uh... Oh, so... I have to ban new words. They're using a new site.
hello, Finn. Seeing those switches on the track make me think I should be hitting them. I think somebody was singing, possibly me, and then I apologized for it. Wow, I don't know why I like the net animation so much, but that was cool. Except for the part where it cast stop, that I'm less fond of. God, I love the chainsaw. I love how cheeky it is. And then I can cure up a Cura on Cyan and not even worry about it. Or I can worry about it and... No, he lives. We good. Oh, we're good. We're done. Five magic AP is a big deal. Time for a nap. Totally taking a nap, even though it doesn't make sense. And then we're going to save. I mean, you gotta bear in mind that Raj is also a cat. 
who, when he went up to space, discovered anti-gravity gear and then got really excited because that meant all of the nappable surfaces in any given room multiplied by six. You were taking too long. I got worried. Where's Celis? We can talk about it later. Let's get out of here. See, the thing is, is that he tried anti-gravity napping and he didn't like it because he just, he, he felt like he couldn't control his dreams. So he prefers gravity naps, but he likes gravity naps on like any surface. Crud! What a mess! <laughs> You're not getting away from me! Boy, that sure does look like it could ruin somebody's day. We'd better not overstay our welcome. Let's get out of here fast. Sounds like an excellent idea, but it seems we're rather in demand. Here they come. I don't like the look of those things. Can't say I'm a fan of all these chainsaw misses. Oh, that's three chocobos on the slots. I don't know what that does, but it's probably good. That's probably not. Okay, the fact that the combat could still go on while one of them was in its death throes was actually really cool. We barely got out of that one. Good lord. Worried about Terra. Let's head back to Zozo. Terra? Who's that? Explain everything on the way about Terra, the Espers, the Returners. Everyone's here. Tara. The 
Magisite. Father? I remember now. I was raised in the Esper world. The Esper world. Madwin, someone's trying to come through the gate. Hey, pull yourself together. Wait, is this a... She's still quite weak. She'll need to rest for a while. Did I wake you? You're an Esper? What's that pendant around your neck? I'll give it to you. A charm from the Esper world. The Esper world? So that's where I ended up. Everyone is at a loss as to how you, a human, could have made it into our world. You're the one who saved me, aren't you? My name is Madeline. I was sick of living in the human world. It's nothing but a pit of greed and hate. So I wandered out into the storm, and before I knew it, I was here. They say that humans and espers can't coexist. Are you saying you don't want me here? No, I'm just not sure. I'll return to my own world tomorrow. All right, someone can show you the way back. That human already left. Wonder if she'll be all right without a guide. That human girl went to the gate quite a while ago. If the humans learned of our powers and decided to try to make use of them, that would be a terrible thing indeed. What's wrong, Madwin? If you don't want to go back to your world, you're welcome to stay here. But humans and espers can't be together. How can we know for sure unless we try for ourselves? How can we know for sure? Unless we... Try for ourselves. And that's how babies are made, children. I've chosen a name for her. What is it? Tara. It's beautiful, isn't it? Two years later. Humans! The nexus between our worlds has opened again. The storm is just like the one two years ago. But this is different from the time Madeline came here. This one brings with it an army that seeks our magical powers. This is no good! Retreat to the Elder's house. Aha! I finally found it. After all that time spent decoding the secrets of those ancient texts, now it's time to reap the rewards. Grab them. Riches to any man who captures an Esper. Go! Tara's all right. We 
We've no choice. We must do the very thing we've been avoiding. You mean the magic barrier? I'll create a tempest to sweep all the invaders out of the realm, then I'll seal the gate. Even among espers, the power to create a magical seal is limited to a single bloodline. I'm the last of that line. But at your age, I may not survive. Without me, you will never again be able to open the gate. Madeline. The other world holds nothing for me. And it's decided we have no other choice. This is all because of that human woman. Nonsense. She could have led them here for all we know. Enough! But she's one of them! It'll only be a matter of time before she decides she wants her power. Oh no! Where are you going? Madeline, she... Oh no, but it's already too late! I've begun activating the seal. You won't be able to return. I don't care. We're, we're being pushed out. No, just when the ultimate treasure was in my grasp. There's something about the image of the Emperor face-planting that has me really amused. Madwin, I'm nothing like them. I know! Thank you. Will you come back home with me? Yes, of course. Terra! Somehow that baby survives that. A human woman and a babe. Leave my daughter alone. Your daughter? Hmm. Then she must be the product of a human and... How fascinating. <laughs> it looks like my dreams of building an empire may come true sooner than I'd ever imagined. <coughs> This world will be mine to rule. <laughs> Is that father's? So I'm the daughter of an Esper and a human. That's why I have these abilities. I should be okay now. I can control this power as long as I only use it in short bursts. Gestal already knew the secret of the Esper's power back then. Those Esper's in the research facility must have been the only ones they grabbed that day. And Celis's power came at the expense of one of them. The Empire won't get away with this. I'll hit that Emperor with a blitz or two. How are things in Narsh? Maybe we should head back and see. The airship's ready to go! Come on. Oh, by all means, take a turn at the wheel. Let me teach you how to fly. Press the confirm button to move forward, change course with left and right directional buttons, adjust altitude with up and down, press the menu button to move inside the ship, once inside you can change party members and purchase items. You can disembark by pressing the cancel button, or press confirm near the ship. Got it? Sure do! Yes! Press and hold the L and R buttons while changing, using direction buttons to move without changing the way the airship's facing. This is especially useful when trying to land. And now we go 
enjoy the fact that we've got an airship. Y'all having fun with your bit war? It's 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 kind of not the same without Goblin complaining about losing his position every so often. Or pleading with somebody to stop. Let's unequip some people. And we're going to equip Terra with her father's magicite. You having fun? Bit wars are a thing on this channel. I'm thankful for it. Do not open door during flight. All right, we've got a party selected. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Gods is vast. Fast airship, fast airship, fast. I love it. The airship is fun. What a place to leave off. We did good today, fam. We got a lot done, and we've got a really interesting party. And when we uh, when we come back next time, um, we're gonna see how this all plays out.